so anyway, we're doing a special Valentine's show, and this is very special. <laughs> for me, definitely. Uh, so I'm going to need you guys to hold on to this for one second. Oh, uh, thank you for joining us. You can take your seat. We'll bring you back on. <laughs> I need one semi-interesting looking article of clothing for a shot, anybody at all. Oh, yeah! Uh, you know, we got a shirt. I think that's great. Yeah, that'll be perfect. Take it off. This. Oh. I was gonna say do it all sexy like, but. as a prop to create as many characters and or little things, scenes, as possible. Improvers at the ready? Got your equipment? Nothing uh, like a good schmitz, am I right, Bradley? Yeah. <laughs> get that, get out of all that toxin. Can I use the towel now, please? No, you cannot. It is mine, and I am getting it very saturated. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, why are you doing my tea? No, I think uh, I ate a boot earlier. No, he's just going to wake up nicely, actually. God. God. Wait. Oh. There is a boot! <laughs> <laughs> I knew it! Good morning, I'm the dog again. Claude Rains! Oh, you're so good to see you. See your floating shirt here. You play the Invisible Man, Donald. Come on. I never get rippers. Question. Yeah. I would 
take her to a <laughs> art <laughs> museum <laughs> with sculptures. <laughs> Sculptureless art museums <laughs> without things you can feel. Gives her a really good idea of what. Never mind. Because, <laughs> like, sculptures have small. Anybody else have a question? Right here, right here in the front. How do I figure out if I like men or women? Or women? Or women? I try everything. <laughs> Love question? Wow, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this guy. Uh, my girlfriend kissed me on the first date, and I'm kind of nervous she's a whore. <laughs> <laughs> is, that, is she with you right there now? <laughs> Had a lot going on, right? Um, and she 
had given her daughter condoms on for the time that as any responsible parent would. Right, but a responsible parent would know that condoms do have expiration dates. Oh. And, so, <laughs> and so my girlfriend's mother gave us an expired condom to use for our first time. It it wasn't quite itchy because it broke um, during the during the very start of it. Um, and me having never done this before, had no idea. Um, and this is also the story of the, of the one and only time I asked my mother to buy me Plan B. Um, but I saved the night because I had already made reservations at Benihana. And so after all this had taken place, we sat there very quietly, staring at our plates. <laughs>
away from it was this. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You don't gather anything from the scene other than the same thing every sixth grader in the audience did. Yeah. <laughs> Valentine's Day, and I know that most of these guys, well, some of them, are just, God, depressingly lonely. Aww. Uh, so, <laughs> uh, let me phrase it to you this way. Have you guys ever seen The Bachelor? Yeah. 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 Right. That's exactly what's about to happen here. Andrew, the loneliest and singlest of us all. <laughs> so that you wouldn't have to be alone tomorrow night. Now, you will be going home with one of these uh, gorgeous performers tonight. Uh, but first, uh, let's hear a little bit about yourself. Ladies and gentlemen, our contestant on The Bachelor tonight, Andrew Fourlines. He likes things. Contestants, bachelorettes. It's all right, bachelorettes. We'll go with that. <laughs> these guys, these guys all have something terribly, terribly wrong with them. What um, what's a horrible secret to keep from someone you're dating? Herpes. Herpes. <laughs> the fact that you have herpes. What, um, in terms of the worst personality trait, what was wrong with your ex? Narcissist. I heard, hold on, I heard narcissist, egotistical, and clingy. Okay, I almost thought the three of you dated the same person. Uh, you are, you are narcissistic as hell. But himself. also, you're already really, really attached to him. <laughs> and, uh, what... <clears throat> what's, your, what's your favorite quality in a person? Like, they don't even want to hide anything about themselves, <laughs> like at all, ever. Hey, 
I'm a paraphrased. <laughs> <laughs> not? We were having a moment. Okay. I want to okay.
just enjoy my own time in you this. You guys aren't paying any attention to my. In this sauna. Private part. Put it back up, guys. <laughs>
Now, I just mark male. That's not the box you would mark, correct? <laughs> okay. Nothing at all. Like, this is C female. Good. My That's name. Surprise. <laughs> <laughs> uh, then, yeah, I put in my address. Right. I'm going to put your address. Is that We're going to live good? together now. That's We're married. Yeah, that's good. Um, no. uh, let me tell you my address. Yeah, definitely. Okay. <laughs> Mark owns a samurai sword. <laughs> Why? <laughs> it's, uh, but that's in Pueblo. <laughs> The 
calling it? Are we calling it yeah. first? You say your name. Say a name. Say a name. First name I hear. Oh, damn it. Oh, damn it. I heard Bob ever tie in the history of the Jester's Court. So what I need is for you two guys to please vacate the premises. Oh. And for the last shot coupon, I need someone to come up here and sit in this chair and get hit on. Oh, we've got this guy right here. Thanks for coming on stage. What I need to happen here is you guys are going to give me the name of a profession. We're all going to give him a pickup line as a member of that profession. And then you have to tell us whose was the best. Okay. So, what's a, what's a job? What's a job? Professional what? Professional what? Professional what? Professional what? Professional Professional bowler, big up like the professional bowler for this round. <laughs> I'd like to split your pants. <laughs>
Yeah.